rolled in this weekend's, uh, all rolled on this weekend at least. Nick Charles has this report on the new Center Four's coaches poll and coverage of the important Prince George's battle between Largo and Parkdale. This week we went to Prince George's County and what a game it turned out to be. This was another perfect rivalry. Parkdale was in to play Largo. The Panthers had recently knocked off perennial power Bowie in double A conference action and had run their record to three and one. For Largo, it was a chance to stay unbeaten and keep the lead in this hotly contested lead. Some said, though, that the Lions hadn't beaten much, so this was a major exam for them. Stay head up on him. Don't get outside or get inside. Okay? Last year, Parkdale beat Largo 14-12, so the revenge factor was thrown in, too. But high school football in Prince George's County, especially under the lights for some reason, is more than four quarters of play. It's color, excitement, community pride, and always a good crowd. First quarter action, Largo running back DJ Hagens finds a hole and rips 42 yards up the middle and in. The conversion was good and the Lions had a seven nothing lead. But that was it for offense. Nobody scored another point. Both defenses completely took over. Still in the final quarter, Parkdale came calling, and it looked like they were a cinch to even it up. But look at the Largo defense when it mattered most. That nailed it shut, and Largo had another win. Coach Rocco Romeo said afterwards he never expected to be sitting 5-0 halfway through the schedule. Oh, yes, very definitely so, yes, because when, when we started, we were greed, inexperienced, and we had a lot of people just coming up the JV. And we had several people move in from uh, other schools that moved in and made a big difference. And the kids' attitudes have made a big difference to them. Romeo is one of our voting coaches on the new Center 4 Metropolitan Area Football Poll. Here are the others. This is the way they voted today after reviewing the weekend action. Annandale, with its 30-point win over Wakefield, holds the top spot again. We'll have much more on high school football, including Virginia, the District, and Montgomery County, on a special edition of New Center 4 next Saturday following the World Series game. Nick Charles, New Center 4. That's the football report. NBC Nightly News is next. Join New Center 4 tonight at 11. For all of us, have a nice week.